every time in the fall we decide where we're going to put our ice shack. We put it somewhere and we don't catch any fish and we end up leaving the ice shack here and we'll go over to middle rang or lower rang and fish over there without the shack. We woke up one morning and said we better have an ice house and I took some scrap plastic and wood and threw it together. Coleman gas stove for heat. That works good for that, you know. I mean, it. Oh, you know, yeah, we can have all the luxuries at home. That's for sure. We just put on a pot of coffee. Hey, there, Bruin. I worked on it off and on, but if I really sat right down to it, it'd probably take me two days to build it because it's made out of that uh, insulation. Yeah. Yep. Grandson and grandfather fishing. <laughs> Yeah, when I was packing up at home, I said, boy, it's going to be a nice day. We won't even need a jacket on. And then I got to the end of the lake, and I'm like, yeah, right. Usually my wife calls around lunchtime. She'll come over and eat lunch with me. Used to be years ago. I'd go out and drill holes, set outside traps, you know, and I, you know, put up with the cold. But as you get uh, kind of beat my age, <laughs> the coldness kind of sets in a little bit rank. So me, I'm comfortable to just come out and fish in my ice shack. Yeah.